Senta Lutos protects the last stronghold and ensures the masters of the stronghold take not one step outside. Senta Lutos protects the heart of Atamagia, so the masters of the stronghold may never claim it. Senta Lutos protects me, Sika, so the masters of the stronghold may never catch me. This must be the final resting place of the masters of the stronghold. That is your sole purpose henceforth. This was the final command instructed to Senta Lutos, the last ancient weapon of Sikrakia. Although he brought ruin to Ataraxian, it is thanks to him that the heart is now in my hands. Yolu claimed a portion of his heart, while Vaha earned all of its ire. But me? I just want to embrace that broken heart. Once I get to meet Seeker, that is. <laughs> Even still, you have my gratitude too, since you awoke this stronghold from Vermalkia. And it is also thanks to you that I have completed the first steps to awakening the heart of Atamagia. Hey, you! What evil are you planning to do with the heart? You can't. You know what lies beneath, don't you? The destruction they will bring. Yes, the 100,000 Atours. And soon, that legion will be mine. I did already warn you, though, did I not? The final festival to rebuild the world. Are you planning another three days of darkness? You can't! The suffering you've already inflicted! The three days of darkness? Oh, yes. That. Well, maybe I will, maybe I won't. It would hardly be fun if I told you all my plans now, would it? However, there is one thing I can tell you. It's something much, much grander, I can assure you. The heart of Artemigia is of no use to anyone now, is it? The final Gladios was never held! The heart's been dormant for far too long! Yes, it has been dormant for an awfully long time. And I see no particular reason to awaken it now either. Oh, but that's a minor issue. For simply destroying it will... Well, you already know what that would cause, do you not, child? But should you wish to see firsthand the merciless slaughter an ancient weapon is capable of, then just keep talking. Good. I must go now, and find the second step necessary to activate this heart. Who knows, maybe we'll bump into each other again. Oh. And if you intend to follow me, you might want to deal with this one before you do. Senta Lutos has long contained the entirety of Seeker's malice, and he's been waiting to share it just with you. I'm sure once it absorbs you and your incredible power, it will be a fine source of energy for the rest of Ator's. Well, do your best for me. Me and my hundred thousand Ator's. She's going to activate them, without the Dakimas? But how? How is that possible? I, a assistant! You need to chase that woman! The fate of the world depends on it! Not yet! Deal with this slippery one first! I'll head back and check the records again. Maybe I've missed something. This isn't fling from battle. Call it redirection of resources. You've got this, right? This'll be a breeze for someone like you. Hey, why the long face, assistant? You always do so well on your own.
I chased after you as soon as the paradise opened, but there was no sign of Alessra. She's already made her getaway, nor were there any signs of the architect of Sikrakia. I wonder where he might be. Hurry up and insert that key! This is the final soul magia to obtain a hint from. But how does that wretched witch plan to activate the heart? Does she have secret records we're not aware of, or Seeker's time capsule? This soul magia might provide the answers we need. Hurry up and insert that key! This... Last action. Heart of Automagia. Deciphering Dekia's hidden password. Successful. I know not how much time has passed since I brought the heart of Automagia here, and not to Gladius. I discovered a command deep within the heart. And, after much study, I've succeeded in deciphering it. There is another means of activating the heart of Artemagia, other than the blood of fierce competition you spoke of. 
and that is sacrifice. To lose something of myself for something other than myself. I assume that Master hid this on purpose, and yet, why? Why did he hide it here? With this means of activating the heart, there was no need for him to engage and appeal to me. Was it not he, after all, that sacrificed everything to repel the Dark Invaders? He who watched as the world turned its back on him? Why? <sighs> Why? I wonder if Dekia withheld this from the Dekimas because of how dear they were to him. He didn't care for his own life, but the lives of his disciples. They were clearly precious to him. Sacrificed, yes. Elezra already knew this. Of course she did. And I am now sure of it too. Elezra must have kidnapped all of the architects. These messages we found throughout the long, empty stronghold. Save me, get me out, and I'm waiting. They left those messages, but we've yet to encounter any of them. It has to be because the White Witch kidnapped them. That evil Elezra must be planning to sacrifice the architects to activate the heart of Artemagia. But wait a second. Another door just opened up. Yo, Lu, Yo, Lu, Nokia. It's described here as the forest which conceived the day. First the sun, then the abyss, and now a forest awaits us. We need to restock and get a move on. I'll hurry back and fetch Martha and Lothi. They're probably still distracted by the exchange, those oafs. But if we just leave them there, they'll get all pouty and cause a fuss again. But most of all, we need to save those poor architects and prevent the heart of Artemagia from being awakened. Assistant! You're with this little genius until the end, aren't you?